Meanwhile, Taiwan is conducting its annual missile drills in the island's eastern waters to test its combat readiness and also to demonstrate the might of its armed forces. Now, the island nation's naval headquarters released a footage of its four-day-long exercise showing various types of anti-air and anti-ship missiles, including an American-made Standler missile that could be seen launched from the warships and from the Coast Guard patrolling boats. The Taiwan also showcased its self-made Brave Wind anti-ship missiles, a French-made Mica anti-air missile and also the sky above surface-to-air missiles. These missiles were launched from Jiuping military base in the southern city of Pingtung. The Taiwan's Navy has said that these drills were aimed at testing the Joint Forces combat readiness and also in demonstrating the troops' determination for protecting the island. The drills come at a time when Beijing has called out the United States for allegedly attempting to contain China by using Taiwan, saying that it's nothing but wishful thinking. The China's Defence Ministry spokesperson has said in I quote, there's only one China in the world and Taiwan is an inalienable part of China. He also further warned, that the, United, he warned the United States saying that those clamouring to make the Chinese mainland pay a price should get prepared to pay the price themselves. The United States has been trying to hollow out the One China principle and that includes Taiwan as a part of its territory. The recent remarks by US President Joe Biden during his visit to Asia fueled the tensions in the region. The Biden has said that the United States will stand by its commitment to Taiwan and will provide military support to the island nation if the need were to arise. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.